Melvin's kitchen. Let's go. Into Melvin's kitchen. Okay, what's going on in here? All this for one bloated halfling hero. They could feed a hundred minions. The Reds. Those halflings must be using them to start the cooking fires. Oh, poor Reds. They must use that wheel to control the flames. Go, my minions. Here we go. Ready? We're gonna toast some halflings. Here we go. Oh, you better hurry. And boom. Oh, there they go. No. <laughs> He just keeps saying stuff about it. Are you kidding me? Okay. I can really skip that area up there. Let's hope there's nothing that important. Here, someone go get those. Let's go over here really quick. I just want to see what's back here. If there's anything important or if it's just nothing. It looks like it's a bunch of sheep. Look at that. Let's kill some sheep, boys. Go. There we go. Oh yeah, there's another little thing over there. Not that I need anybody. What is going on? I'm having a very hard time like figuring out what is going on with my mouse or it's gotta be what are okay, I gotta look at the uh who cares? I'll just deal with it. It's, it hasn't been that hard. Okay, come on, boys. I have quite a bit of cash here. It's pretty surprising. Go up the ramp there, boys. <laughs> cha ching, cha ching, cha ching. Get the treasure. Get the treasure and bring it to me. Oh, man. Yeah, look at him. Melvin ain't so small now. <laughs> yeah, look at how nasty he looks. Come on. Come here. Gotta be careful of this guy. Wow. Food. <laughs> wow. Ew, he's so nasty looking. Now look at him go. Squash food. Eat food. Oh man. Oh man, oh man. Go get him, boys. Oh, man, we almost got him. What is he doing? Ew! Ew! Him like a balloon, okay. Well, I guess I'm in charge of that. Ew. That is concentrated evil, sire. It accumulates in those of an especially evil disposition. Ew, he just blew up everywhere. Now you've dealt with Melvin. You should endeavor to find our fiery friends. Oh, yeah, we get to go find the, uh... The fire minion things.
No, I don't want to go back to the tower. I didn't mean to walk over it. Okay, so. Oh, look, there's a guy right there. Hey, buddy! Look at them, they have horns. Okay, they're gonna... Have to find their hive thing. Not really sure where that is. Look after them and they'll look after you. Just like one big evil family. As I explained, reds are fire immune. But they also have a powerful ranged attack. This is where we learn about... If you've reached your maximum minion horde with your browns, you can swap them at the gate. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot they did that too. Look at that. This is red life force, sire. It will allow you to summon more reds. That's the red minion hive master. Summon enough reds to carry it to the waypoint gate. Reds. Get them. Browns. Oh, I guess they can go out there too. Cool. I was thinking that there was going to be uh um, cats. Okay, now we go back here and throw back some brunes and get some reds. Oh, there we go. Now we need to put back two reds. So I click down for all, down. Okay. There we go, boys. Go get the beetles, boys. Don't chase them into the fire, though, you dumbs. Okay, well, look at that. We're moving here. We are moving. Like a bunch of cats. Ah, the perfect opportunity to test out your reds on those halflings. Recall your reds for the red hive and commence the fry and die, sire. Look at them. Good job, Reds. Oh no, what are they doing? Oh no. Browns, get ready. There we go. Everyone go pick up the Red Hive. There we go. Beautiful. And go. Yay, we have the red hive now. Maybe we can get red beans. How do you place a marker? That's what I want to know. That would be a good thing to find out. Oh, what's going on here? You cannot reach them from here. You must reposition your legs for maximum flaming carnage. No, 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 no. Oh, there's the vantage point right there. Sire, you can hold the position of your minions by placing guard markers for them. There, yeah, that's what I wanted to know how to do. Place the guard markers. Because those are very helpful and strategic. Browns to that fire 
Okay, no, you dumb. He got the stupid life force instead of actually going to the wheel. Like, oh, look at this. You dumb, get over there. There were flames. There was carnage. Well done, sire. Come away from that marker. Get back on to the hive. There we go. Beautiful. After <laughs> this game is fun though. <laughs> This part of it's kind of like a maze, though, and it gets kind of annoying. It's understandable, though. And there we go. There's our ticket back. Our ticket to paradise, a.k.a. our tower. There you go, boys. Get that red hive going, and we'll have reds for life. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay. Let's head to the tower. Head to the tower. Not sure what we're going to do here. We're going to do something. Okay. Let's see here. We got to go to... Uh... Oh. We go back to Mellow Hills. Oh, wait. What am I doing? No. I'm probably going to wrap it up here. Who is that? Lord, now you've got rid of Melvin, the sheep are flourishing. The sheep are flourishing. Thanks, sire. They're breeding faster than I can count them. Oh, more sheep. Wow, look at those sheep. <laughs> they look pretty crazy looking. I'll take it. Okay, well, I'm going to go back to the tower. I didn't mean to do that. So I'm going to take a break quick. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying the brand new playthrough of Overlord. It's actually fun. Uh kind of like like I said it's kind of like Pikmin. Oh, oh yeah, that's what I was going to do. I was going to go find that other thing. Never mind. I'll do that later anyway. So, hope you guys are enjoying and I will see you on the next sex section session thing.